Our next award tonight is the Philip Philip Mitchell Alumni Service Award. Established in 1981, the award recognizes individuals who have provided exemplary service to our alma mater. It is my pleasure to announce the Philip Philip Mitchell Alumni Service Award recipient, Rick Abegg. Rick graduated in 1983 from the College of Earth and Mineral Sciences. In addition to Rick's day job as a geologist with Chevron, he also acts as a corporate recruiter, advocate, and champion of Penn State students. Rick is involved in the college's alumni society, GEMS, graduates of Earth and Mineral Sciences. Through GEMS, he mentors students as they succeed in finding jobs, getting accepted into graduate school, and becoming involved in professional competitions. These students develop into engaged alumni and continue to positively bring forward service to Penn State. We have a short video we'd like to share with you, highlighting Rick and the important service he provides to Penn Staters. There's some real corny ones that I tell things like, uh, that's nice, but don't take it for granted. It's nice being a metamorphic rock. There aren't a lot of great geology jokes. <laughs> I often wonder whether I got my enthusiasm for mentoring from my parents. Both my parents were educators. My mom was an English teacher. My dad was a, a professor of philosophy. And that may have been kind of what rubbed off on me. I've been recruiting earth scientists here at Penn State for 20 years. The GEMS Board put together a mentoring program, and the, the idea there was to connect our alumni to the students, and I think that we can give a different perspective than what the academic folks here on campus can give. So think probabilistically, right? What if it's a fault? What if it's not a fault? How does that change my prospect? Look up and down, see if there's any evidence of seismic sort of velocity anomalies. Pull up, push I've uh, come in and talked to petroleum geology classes. I help introduce them to, to how we use science in the search for oil and gas. And, and I think it gets them enthusiastic about that work. They've done very well, and the quality of technical work that I've seen from them is excellent. And so, in a sense, I help get them started on, on a career. I think it was really my avenue to, to connecting back to Penn State. And it's, and it's rewarding to see that, that they're successful. Congratulations, Rick. Would you like to say a few words? Uh, the power of editing to make me sound coherent. <laughs> uh, it's really an honor to, to be up here. And uh, similar to the others, I, I just can't resist doing this. Uh, we are. Penn State. We are. Penn State. Thank you. So as volunteers, we should think of ourselves as, how am I Penn State? As a member of, of alumni council or your college alumni boards or your department alumni boards, you've been given a gift uh, to serve this great institution. And part of the reason I'm up here receiving this award is I always try to do a bit more than just be on that board. Uh, each of you should look for an opportunity to, to serve beyond that, uh, whether it's giving a talk to a class or a student organization or, or visiting with students about a career. So don't finish your service here at Penn State um, regretting that you haven't done more. Be able to proudly state that I am Penn State. There, there's a few groups and individuals I would like to thank. I'd like to thank the Penn State Alumni Association for recognizing volunteer efforts. I'd like to thank the Department of Geosciences for, for their confidence in me as far as being a mentor. Uh, I especially like to thank uh, GEMS, the graduates of Earth and Mineral Sciences Alumni Board. They helped connect me back to the university. I want to thank Colleen Swetland for, for bringing me onto this board and for all her support through the years as an alumni relations contact for our board. And also uh, Joel Reed, who's our current president and I think a, a potential nominee in the future for this award. <clears throat> you can thank me later, Joel. Um, and I want to thank Chevron, my employer, for their support for my volunteer work. And lastly, my spouse for sharing me with Penn State. Thank you very much.
careful. Just sits in there. 